I'm sorry that I took off like that. It's just I left the oven on at home. Uh, for like 12 hours? Yep. I know. <laughs> Mental, right? Yeah. Anyway, I just wanted to say that I had a really good time with you yesterday. And no, 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 I don't just mean the, you know. <laughs> no, although that part was really good too, don't get me wrong. Listen, Tony, I'm, I'm really sorry, but for me that was just a, a one-time thing. I was, I was actually quite relieved when you snuck out. So you don't want these? No. Oh, thank God. Okay, so look, I'm on my way to a date and I'm pretty sure I left my watch here yesterday. Can you... Why well, should you shut the fuck up? Will you shack someone else? Please. In my own house! <laughs> Look. I'm sorry, okay? I didn't mean. It's just. I love you so much, too much. And I put the seat down because I know you want me to. You asked me to, remember? Yeah. So when I see it left up, I think you've got another man in the house. It's an honest mistake, okay? I'm sorry. Do you forgive me? Mm-hmm. Not a girl. Come here. She'll be happier with the other chap. Marcus. Yes. That's not what I meant. I spoke to Billy the other day. He told me some stories from the front. He was never at the front. Yes, of course. Not like you, but... He said you were with the Colonel when... I'm sorry, I, I didn't mean to upset you. You didn't. John, I... Look. Thank you for coming, Tom. I do appreciate it. Say hello to your sister for me, will you? What? what? Hey, come on, you can tell me anything. Do you remember when we first started going out and I had to go to my aunt's for a few months? Yeah, I remember, because it was the longest two months of my life. My aunt wasn't sick. Okay. I was in hospital. What did you, why did you have an accident or something? No, I was late, very late. The test was positive. What? I thought, I thought if I told anyone, I'd be forced to keep